Ok. Rồi. Day ở đây. First one, the day. Bình thường mình nói từ day là ngày đúng không? Right. Thì day này có nghĩa là một cái day ở trong tuần như là Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Nhưng mà khi mà cô hỏi what date is it today? Thì cái điều cô cần ở đây là ngày tháng. Đó là cái ngày trong tháng đó. Là ngày số bao nhiêu? Và tháng mấy? Sao? Trước hết khi muốn muốn trả lời câu hỏi này thì mình có thể trả lời trước về cái thông tin của từ đây luôn. It is... Hôm nay là thứ mấy nhỉ? Friday. Yeah, it is Friday. And the date? Mm. The date mm. is... 24th September. Yeah, September. Or you can say Friday, September 24. Okay, hai cái thông tin này có thể đỡ đảo vị trí cho nhau không sao nhé. 24, uh, 24th, 24th, nhớ nhà âm thờ nè. September hoặc là September 24. Okay. Now, okay, tell me, how's the weather today? Weather. Yes, how's is... the weather? Huh? It is? It's sunny. Oh, really? It is sunny. sunny. Ask me, ask me. And you? And you how? Or you can say, what's the? What's the weather? Like today, what like. what the weather like today? Oh my God, here is so wet, cold and rainy all the day. So now rainy. let's say yes, it's rainy. Only only rainy in the afternoon. Oh, here um in my place, it's rain from the morning until now. It is raining right now. Rain all the day. Yeah, so I whenever I get out of the house, I need to wear a raincoat every time. And mm -hmm. because of the rain, I feel so cold and so wet. There is water, um, there is water everywhere. I don't like it. Do you like raining? Do you like raining? I'm sorry, do you like rainy season? No. No. So, what kind of weather do you like? I like wind. Oh, you like windy weather? Why? Why do yeah. you like windy weather? Why? Because so cool. Huh? So cool. Uh, so you say because it make me feel. You can say that because. It's so cool. I feel because I feel so cold. Oh, you feel it's so cold in that weather? Okay. Yes, maybe, but actually, um, I, I don't like windy very much. It's cool, right? But when whenever you go outside, I have to ride a motorbike, okay? I ride a motorbike, so when it is windy, it makes my eye hurt. Yes, it hurts my eyes with a lot of wind, and I will broke into tears. It's gonna, my eyes gonna be red, and I don't like that. I just like uh, cloudy weather. Cloudy, cloudy. No wind. yes, not too much sun, but no rain, no wind. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of uh, milk. It's kind of milk. Okay, now today we continue with the last lesson we learned about the weather. Today we're gonna share some information about the weather. Okay, so how about your weather? Is it hot or cold? It's hot. Ah, uh, yeah, so it is so hot or it's hot. Mm, for example, me. I like cloudy, oh my God. For example, the pink sticker day, I like cloudy weather because I love walking in rain. That is the sticker, not me. <laughs> How about you? 
Okay, another speaker say, we like sunny weather because we love going to the beach. We like windy weather because we love sailing on the sea. So remember, you like some kind of weather and the reason is an action. Remember, an action, huh? Action. Yes, so you need to answer two questions. What kind of Weather do you like? Do you like what can okay actually this do. one is uh, what can you do in in this weather? Yes, exactly in this weather or in that weather. Okay. I will ask you first, I will do later, okay? okay. Yes. So uh, Mia, what kind of weather do you like? I like windy. Uh, I like windy weather. Remember the word weather. Okay, why do you like windy weather? What can you do? Because I like... Um, I like... Fly my kite. Ah, you like. So lie, after lie, we have two ways. We have two ways to say after lie. We say lie with verb ing or lie with two verb. With Which one? Which one? I like when they weather because I lie. So you have got the verb fly, right? To fly or flying. Which one? Choose one. Fly, mm. flying my kite. Uh, flying my kite. Thank you. That is good. Or you can say, I mm. like to fly my kite. It's the same, huh? It's the same for it. This is your answer. Now this time to my, you can ask me and I will answer. Ask me, okay. please. What kind of weather do you like? Um, I like cloudy weather. Cloudy weather. Hmm? Next one, next question. Why you like this weather? Oh, yes. I yeah. like this weather because I uh, can go out and take a lot of photos. I love yeah. taking photos, right? Okay. Now, for example, okay, we got this. But I want you to, uh, I want to give you some situation. For example, one people say that I like hot weather. Can you give me a reason for this? Why? Why people like hot weather? Because, Give me a reason. Mm, because, mm, they, because they like go to the beach. Uh, they like. Go they like. The đúng chưa? Có đúng là they like go to the beach không? Going. Yes, going. Hoặc là to go to the beach. Oh, some people say that uh, they like um, rainy weather. Rainy weather? Yes. Why? Why do they like that? Because they like cold. Because they I like cold. cold. Cold? Cold? What cold? No, cold là một cái tính từ, con không thể dùng là they like cold. They like They like What can we do when it's raining? Oh. 
Really? Taking shower in the rain? Not everyone like this. No, because, for example, okay, what, what do you often do when it's rainy? What do you often do? Say, say it. Hmm? I... When it's raining, what can you do? You watch TV. Uh, you can watch TV. What else? And drink hot chocolate. Ah, hot chocolate. 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 No, my told my chocolate. No, no, I'm sure. Yeah, chocolate. 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 Yes, chocolate. Chocolate. Yeah. So you can say they like to drink. Drink. Hot, hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. Easy. Cool. Some people just like something because the simple reason. Okay, another situation. Some people said they like snowy weather. Why? Why they like? Why do they like snowy weather? Because, because, because they like, uh, they like, sorry, like, what can we do when it's snowy? Play in. What kind of sport can we play in this weather? We have a very famous sport. Next, no mean. No, it's not kind of sport. Okay, it's just an action. They like making snowman is okay, but no what kind of sport. Skating. Uh, what? No, not skating. Skating for sunny weather. I skate. I skate. I skate. Or you can say, because they like I skating. Okay. Or they like going skiing. You know, Me? skiing. 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 Yes. Yeah. I skating and going skiing is different. Skating. So you just need two kind of shoe. Yeah. Yes. Yes, you see, okay, well, I will draw it for you. For example, this is the normal shoe. Okay, no. <laughs> this one is normal shoe, right? When you go ice skating, you need something here. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Yes, but with skiing, skiing, you need two things. You need four things. You need this one. And to big, uh, big and long, it's this long palette right here. Yeah, this is skiing. Yes, you can step on that and go from the mouth, the top of the mountain to the bottom of the mountain. You're gonna go from the high place to the low, low place like this. But ice skating, mm. you just lay it on the, the how to say Winter. that? Yeah, it's on the winter, but for example, I play ice skating okay, so, in the winter. Yeah. Ice skating, you can play it on the ice, but with skiing, you play it on the snow. Different. No. Ice and snow. Ice skating là cái trò trượt băng, là con sẽ chơi trên mặt băng và mặt băng là nó phẳng và nó bằng đúng không? Có nhìn thấy người ta có môn thể thao chiếu ở trên đó, những cái cô mà váy nhẹ 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 đó, xoay 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 đó. Còn đối với cái trò skiing thì con sẽ chơi trên tuyết và con sẽ leo lên núi và con trượt xuống. Núi trượt xuống. Yes, exactly. Nó sắc khác nhau ở chỗ đó thôi nha. Đó, cái giày nó cũng khác nhau nè. Bên kia chỉ cần đeo đôi giày có cái chân trượt là được. Còn bên này thì mình cần hai quay trống nè. Rồi mình cần cái dây kiểu đặc biệt thứ hai cái ván ở dưới chân đó. Or you like skiing, skiing cũng được mà going skiing cũng được. Okay. Next one. 
Oh, look at this one. Today we're gonna telling a story. And look at this one, Vicky. This is Vicky. See, this girl. Vicky is really? painting. Yeah, Vicky is painting class. Now we complete the first part of the story. This is Vicky, the girl with blonde hair and red t-shirt. No, okay, mm -hmm. look at this one. I have some blanks for you. It is something days at Vicky, something. Vicky in her painting something, he's drinking, what can I? Okay, let's get the word. For example, when we talk about day, we can look out of the window. And where is she right now? What is she thinking? She... Oh, you can write down. You can write on, uh, write in the blanks. So we can count the word. Uh, For example, the first word, I need a six letter. You can type a word and you can use the spade. Con gõ một lần luôn nhưng mà con sẽ dùng dấu cách á. Chứ mình đừng gõ từng chữ như vậy nó bị lâu ha. Thay vì con cách một lần thì thay vì con viết bình thường là con không cách đúng không? Like normal way. Con sẽ không cách nhưng mà khi mà con viết những cái chữ này thì con có thể cách ra. Like this. Huh? And make the word bigger. Viết to hơn xíu. Chill the side. Make it bigger. All this bit. Where is Vicky? Yes, you can see on the title. Title. Yes, the title of the story. You can look everywhere on the screen. By the way, maybe there are some hints for you. So how about the weather? What day is it? What kind of the weather? What kind of weather is it? Can you see, look out of the window. Yeah. Storm, rain, it is for any rain.
Where is Vicky? Where is she? It is already on the screen. Everything. Faster, faster. We, we have some more picture about this. Not only this one. We still have some more picture. So count a word. See, we have six letter. So what kind of day is it? You can see, is it sunny? No. So it is snowy? Yeah. No, we have six letter. Six letter, a word with six letter. Dimna. Every kind of weather with six letter. You only have um, two minutes or three things faster. Cloudy. Is that the right thing? Rồi, về nhà là viết lại cái từ này nha. Viết sai tiếng tạ không ạ? How does look cloudy again? How many letter is it? How many letter did you write? Six. Really? Okay, you can finish this one and this one. Right now, I will check it. After that, yeah. can you do it? Oh, sorry, can you do them? Yes or no? One more minute for you. Finish? Actually, we are running out of time, so I have to check it out. Okay, so look at the first one. It's a, you see, cloudy. Cloudy is a good answer. But let's count how many words did you write? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you write wow. seven words. So you know that? Cloudy is right. Cloudy is right, but you write is wrong. Sorry about this. I need to move the word over here. Now let's see what did you write. You see, you have the word cloudy like this, huh? Oh my God, why is that way disappear like this? But my word cloudy. Is here. There is no letter N. No N. I told you. Từ này hôm trước học cô đã nhắc rồi nè. Và trong cái bài tập về nhà cũng biết sai hết. Cloudy. No N. Okay. It's a cloudy day at Vicky school. Okay. See, she is in her class. So actually, the class in school, and you can see we only. We have the answer here. Vicky in her painting class. It's so easy to find it. She's thinking, what can I draw? So one right questions for you. Just one, I will uh, 
like a star right here. One star. Now let's go with the second picture. Now you tell the story. You need to answer some questions and tell the story. Next time you're gonna tell story by yourself. Okay, look at the picture. We have always have some questions. Where is Vicky now? Mm, Vicky is in library. Uh, Vicky is in the library. And what is she thinking about? She's thinking. She's about thinking. Juice, juice, juice book. Thinking about book? No, look at this one. What is she thinking about? Choose. She's not thinking what? about the book or choosing the book. She is in the high library, but you see that can uh, did Vicky draw something? Did Vicky draw something? Yes or no? No. No. So she is thinking about her drawing, her picture, but has she got any ideas? Hmm? Has she got any idea for the picture? Look at this one. No, no, not yet. So she is thinking about her picture, but she hasn't got, got any got any ideas. Idea. Okay, you know how to do it. I will make you to write the say the answer by yourself. Okay, picture number three. Now, where is Vicky? Where is she? He is. Mm, her room now. Uh, she is in her room now. And what she's looking at? She's looking for Randall. Huh? What is she looking at? She, she is looking at the rainbow. Oh, yes, the rainbow. And has she got an idea now? No. Yes. Yes or no? Do you think yes or you think no? Look at her. No, really? You see, she is smiling. Smiling. So that means yes, she got idea. Look at her in picture number two. When she got no idea, she is not smiling. She's not smiling. She's thinking. Look at her face. Her face look mm. like that. Khi mà con tìm được giải pháp thì con vui con sẽ cười chứ. She is smiling. So, Vicky's at home in her room and looking at a rainbow. Now she got a, idea, a good idea. Okay? Rồi, trả lời câu hỏi là một chuyện nhé. Vậy là khi mà con làm các cái... Kể một câu chuyện này, con phải suy nghĩ xem. Đầu tiên, khi người ta cũng nói về, về cái hoàn cảnh chung, thấy không? Nói về cloudy day nè, Vicky at school, nghĩa là mình sẽ nói từ những cái rộng trước. Nghĩa là nói về nơi trốn của nhân vật đang ở đâu. Tiếp theo là mình mới nói về cái hành động của nhân vật đang làm gì. Và cô không cần nhiều, chỉ cần 3, 3 2 đến 3 câu hỏi là được. Câu, bức tranh số 2 người ta cũng hỏi tương tự, where is Vicky now? Người ta phải xác định được cái vị trí Vicky trước. Rồi sau đó mới nói về cái hành động Vicky. Và cái vấn đề của Vicky đặt ra từ bức tranh số 1 đã được giải quyết chưa? Chưa. Tiếp theo, picture number 3. Thì lúc này chúng ta đã thấy Vicky đã thay đổi địa điểm một lần nữa. Và lúc này hành động cô ấy cũng đã thay đổi. Và cái vấn đề của bạn ấy cũng đã có chút thay đổi. 
Ok Khi kể chuyện bất kỳ một câu chuyện nào Một bức tranh nào con cũng thế Và lưu ý khi nào trong đầu nhé Hôm sau khi, khi đi kiểm tra Chắc chắn là con sẽ gặp một bài kể chuyện Chắc chắn Sẽ gặp 100% luôn Thì lúc này con sẽ phải tự đưa ra Những cái câu hỏi này trong đầu để mà trả lời Nghĩa là mình chỉ đặt câu trả lời Đọc câu trả lời cho cô thôi nha đó, khi con miêu tả từng bức tranh là con phải miêu tả cho cô đó. Đầu tiên là ở đâu, vị trí, nơi trốn. Thứ hai là hành động và thứ ba là mình nói đến cái vấn đề mà xảy ra ở trong bức tranh. Có một số câu chuyện thì nó có một vấn đề từ đầu đến cuối. Nhưng có một số câu chuyện thì cái vấn đề đó nó xảy riêng ra từng bức tranh. Nói chung là mình nói về cái hành động của người ta. ha Đó, quan trọng là nơi trốn và hành động. Nào, number four. Bây giờ con sẽ tự kể cái bức tranh số 4 này, cô sẽ không hỏi nữa. Nó sẽ tự thành câu giống như cái câu hồi nãy này. Vicky is at home now. She is looking at a rainbow. Now she got a good idea. Okay, you make it by yourself. You have one minute. Just say it. You don't have to write when you say it. Okay. This one, this time I can let you to write, but next time you have to say it. What is in your painting? Hmm? Yes, what is her painting? Her painting, that means her picture. Painting. Her painting, that means the picture. Her painting here, this is her painting. This is her painting. What is her painting? Painting the rainbow. Write it down. Who says wedding? The woman, who is that woman? Vicky in her school, her class, so who's that woman? Tell me. His teacher. Uh, her teacher. So you can say, change her the woman. Teacher. Yes, change the word. Change the word. Okay, I will. Yes, I will. I think that I can show you because this is so slow. So look at this one. Vicky in her classroom again, or is in the painting class? Good. And there's a rainbow in Vicky's picture, or she's painting the rainbow. Actually, 
Mm. You are right, but it's not 100%. She is draw painting. Painting là lúc đấy là cô ấy đang, cái hành động đang xảy ra. Nhưng ở đây là cô ấy đã xong rồi mà. So you can say, she paints, paint a rainbow. Or there is a rainbow in Vicky picture. Nó sẽ đúng hơn. Không sao, câu này cô vẫn chấp nhận được acceptable. Nhưng mà nó chưa phải 100% nha. And her teacher says, well done. Good. Vậy thì khi mà kể một bức tranh, lần sau cô sẽ không cho nó hiện cái câu hỏi này nữa đâu. Con phải tự nhớ và con tự trả lời nhé. Đầu tiên là hỏi về gì nhỉ? Hỏi về ở đâu. Ừ, ở đầu, chính xác. Sau khi hỏi về ở đâu thì bắt đầu mới hỏi về các cái hành động. Mới trả lời về các cái hành động xảy ra trong bức tranh. Ok. Now match the sentence in story picture. Write one, two, three or four. So look at this one. Number one. Well, look at that rainbow. It is beautiful. And I think that it is in picture number three. Okay. Now for number the second picture. That's a really pretty picture, Vicky. So which one? Okay, you can write down. One, two, three, four. So we have one, two, and four left. So there's just one thing left. Easy. Yes. So tell me, number two, is it okay? Number three, read it for me. Number three, read it. Number three, well, look at that rainbow. Number three. No, no, sorry. The, the sen sentence number three, not the picture number three. The sentence number three. And the number three. My friends got a great idea, but I haven't. Mm -hmm. Number four, that's right. I can find any good pictures in this library or on this website. Oh, dear. Yes. Uh, website. Website. Do you know website? No. Actually, website is something we search on the internet. For example, Google is a website. What? Website. Website. In Vietnam, we say trang web. Trang web nghĩa là sao? Nghĩa là một cái yeah. trang. Yeah. Trang web biết đúng không? Yes, we search on Google. Và nó có ra rất là nhiều cái kết quả. Và cái kết quả đấy, mỗi kết quả đấy nó nằm ở một cái đường link. Cái đường link đó là một cái website khác nhau. Đó, trang web ha. Okay, next one. This is good. Now, draw four window like this in your notebook and write the number from one to four. And okay, this is can be your kind of your homework, but first we're gonna do this one. I will make an example for you. So I have a window like this. And I will draw 
everything like this. Okay, is it hot or cold? First one, what is like? What is it hot or cold? You choose. You choose. Draw. Yes, I will draw, but draw. you choose. Okay, I will draw something here, but I don't know what to draw. So I need you to talk about the weather and I will draw it. Okay, every second you choose one element. Now the first one, hot or cold? Mm. What do you choose? Hot or cold? I choose hot. So you say it is? It is hot. So it is sunny, windy, or cloudy? It's sunny. Sunny. Oh, it is sunny. Thank you. Is it raining or snowing? Snowy. Really hot, sunny, and snowing? No, never happened together. <laughs> okay, so I will choose raining. This one, can you see a rainbow in that picture? Yes. Yes, oh my God, you have a lot of things. So I will draw something for you. So is it hot, right? I got, at, yes, I got, is it hot and it's sunny? So there will be no clouds. No clouds, only the, the sun. And it is raining too. Oh my God, it's hot and it's raining. Oh, see, you make hot for me. <laughs> okay, it's rain here, but it's sunny here. <laughs> <laughs> and with, between the rain and the sun, I have the rainbow. <laughs> yes. Green, green, blue, blue, purple, green, oh, that blue green. first. And the last one is purple. Okay, I finished. Is it good? <laughs> okay, so in com combiner, uh, combination, you can say like that. It is hot, sunny, and raining. I can see a rainbow too, or a rainbow there. Okay, I am very mm -hmm. good. Now I will say it, and you're gonna draw. Okay, you draw. Now you draw. Hmm. Let me choose for you. So I like this kind of weather. It is cold. Cold? Uh-huh. It is cold. It is windy. Windy? It is snowing. And I cannot see any rainbow. Yes, draw it. Cold? Yeah, it is cold. How can we draw cold? No. Yes, yeah, you have to draw everything. Okay. It is windy and it is snowing. Snowing. What are you drawing? I'm drawing snow. Snowflake. You are drawing snowflake. Mm. Is that is that right? Okay, after this one, I will. I will teach you how to draw snowflake. It is very easy. 
you don't have to do that. It is too, it takes a lot of time. Okay, it's snowing. Remember, it is windy too. It is windy and cold. Okay. No. Okay, snowflake bent. No. Oh, windy, how about windy? How you show me windy? Okay, draw windy here. Oh, nice. Cold. I don't know. Oh my God. Remember, I give you some exercise about this. When you look at the picture, you know cold, and now you try it again. Okay. Are you done? Actually, if you say code, if I say code, you just say zero degrees, right? Zero Celsius degree. Uh, oh. uh, yeah. Yes, yeah. it's just that, okay. Or you can draw a temperature like this. You remember this one? Ah, you remember this one? Can you get it? This one is only here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, you can say it's two minus two Celsius degree. Okay, so I will make. Uh, I will um, teach you how to draw a snowflake. It's easy. Draw like me. Next time, when you draw a snowflake, just make some line like this. It is a snow kind of snowflake. Make two long line and make two short lines. And you make some arrow like this. See? Mm -hmm. Yes. Next time you're gonna draw inside. Inside a longer mm -hmm. one. Yes, mm -hmm. like this. And inside a short one. Two. So we have a snowflake right now. Is that beautiful? Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. so okay. Look, Next time I, you can draw like me, huh? Yes. Yes, okay. But I think that is enough for today. So let's see you in the next lesson. Okay, remember mm. to learn the word cloudy with no cloudy. N. Yes, with no N. And the word website and the word date. Mm -hmm. What date is it? Okay? Date. Yeah. Yes, the date. Goodbye. Bye. See you later. Bye bye.